Hello and welcome to the software engineering track of Pangkarniwan Developer. Oh, it's si Bray and I will be guiding you through the world of software engineering. Uh, ano ba ulit? Ano ba yung software engineering na yan? Ano ba yung connection yan sa ibang uh, uh, engineering na fields tulad ng civil engineering, chemical engineering, electrical engineering, at kung ano-ano pang engineering. Well, well, may malaking debate dyan sa about software engineering. Kasi, for one thing, compared sa ibang engineering na fields, medyo bata pa ang software engineering. Uh, for instance, civil engineering uh, has been around for tens of thousands of years in one form or another. Kasi people have been building things, magawa sa mga buildings na nakatayo na at hindi gumuguho na lang basta-basta. Uh, compared yan sa computer science and computers sa whole, uh, less than two centuries pa lang ang uh, computers and it's been less than a century. Wala, wala pa tang 50 years, 50, 60 years na nagawa tayo ng talagang maraming gumagamit ng computers. Kaya, there's a debate whether software engineering should be called software engineering. Kasi ang point ng engineering is parang technology yan eh. So, yung learning nyo dun sa if sinunod-sunod nyo tong mga tracks na to. Uh, sa programming, software development track natin, it's more of technology. You're applying yung knowledge na natunan mo sa computer science to uh, computer. So, applied na science siya. Engineering is similar. Uh, in essence, yung tinatutunan mo na concept, software development, tinatutunan mong concept sa computer science, you're going to apply it to build things. So, building programs, building systems na ibibigay mo sa kliyente mo para ma-solve yung mga problema ng kliyente mo. Or ma-solve ng problema ng customers or kahit sa sarili mo. The engineering part comes with the uh, yung parang there's the ethics uh, part yung uh, ethics reliability and all that kaya nga yung mga uh, ibang courses ibang fields meron silang certified engineer kasi kung mare again main thing pinasika syempre civil engineer you're hi- you're getting civil engineers to make sure that the structures you create don't uh, don't collapse. Kunwari, nagkarnalin doon, hindi lang basta-basta yan guguho. Because there are lives on the line. Ang problema nga sa software, hindi pag ganun ka mature ang computing. Hindi pag ganun ka mature yung mga debel, yung the whole uh, ecosystem, as a, yun niya, the whole ecosystem, uh, hindi pa siya ganun ka mature na masasabi mo kung gumawa ang isang pangkarniwan developer na isang program, masasabi mo napaka-reliable yan. Uh, well, syempre may mga ibang engineer gumagawa ng mga bagay na hindi ganun ka 100% reliable. Pero, the mere, mere concept na halos lahat ng mga developers, uh, hindi man halos lahat, karamihan ng mga developers na hindi talaga uh, ganun ka sabihin na natin, hindi ganun ka-passionate sa kanilang craft. Hindi ganun ka... Yan, parang hindi ganun ka-seryoso sa craft nila. Okay lang sa nagmuha ng mga software na hindi reliable. And another thing rin is yung... Uh, sa engineers, you have to build things on time. Kasi yung reliability, not just yung reliability mo na... Uh, yun niya hindi basta-basta magka-crash yung system mo. Yung reliability na, pag binigyan kita ng kontrata, may kontrata tayo, gagawan mo ako ng system, gagawan mo ako ng program, na sa ganun tong period of time, sabihin natin, isang taon, magagawa, pagdating ng isang taon, madideliver mo yan. Uh, sa software, it's a problem with a lot of developers na hindi nila kayang i-deliver. Uh, kaya nga, malaki yung... Uh, uh, malaking problema sa software engineering kaya hindi siniseryoso mga engineers yung mga software engineers. But, then again, uh, that doesn't stop us na to try 
to strive na maging mature yung craft natin, maging mature yung industry natin. So yun, uh, in this track, we are going to focus on uh, being decent software engineers. And ang habol natin is not just merely yun niya, yung reliability thing. Sa software engineering, doon ang makikita, it's uh, not just merely focusing on reliability. It's more of focusing on not just the problem, not just the solution, but also the people involved in doing the solution. Uh, dun, madalas yung may kita na, uh, I think, madalas na may kita na common theme na may kita nyo dito sa track na to, is ang uh, software is ang success, kumbaga. Nung main indicator kung magsasucceed yung software, kung maganda yung software ay sa tao. Hindi yan hindi yan nakasalalay kung uh, anong programming language ginamit mo, kung anong operating system, anong machine ginamit mo. Kadalasan ang uh, mga projects, mga programs, mga systems, software projects, they are mostly reliant on people. So anong people yan? Uh, so, for instance, yung teams. You're working in a team, a software development team. Kailangan maayos yung communication, yung uh, paano, paano kayo nag-cooperate as a team. Uh, yun, we're going to be covering parts of that. Uh, how you could build a software as a team. And also, hindi lang sa team nyo, the other uh, uh, there are other yun nga, na, uh, uh, shareholders uh, sa system nyo. Well, obviously, there's a clients. Kailangan natin i-manage yung clients. That's also a common team. We're going to manage yung clients natin. Customers natin. That's a very big part in software engineering. And also, the management. Kasi, uh, kung hindi kung hindi aligned yung tatlong yun, yung uh, developers, software development team, uh, the management, uh, the management, and finally yung uh, customers. Wag na kayong umasa yung ginagawa yung project ay uh, magiging ganun ka-successful. Uh, that's something na hindi ganun tinuturo sa school kasi kahit mga companies, they don't really focus that much. Pero, fortunately, mayroon mga na, nabibisita ang schools na they know na importante yun, the person aspect. So, here in software engineering, we're going to be discussing mainly processes, uh, processes, methodologies, uh, sometimes tools uh, na ginagamit natin sa pag-build ng software. Pero, the end thing is, halos lahat ng mga didiscuss natin has something to do with people. Has something to do with yun, human beings. People. <laughs> At, and how they relate. Uh, how they work inside yung ating paano tayo nagagawa ng uh, mga software. So, it may sound weird right now, pero yeah. Mat- matatotonan nyo rin yun. Ma- may guess nyo rin yun as you go along uh, dun sa mga lessons natin, mga tracks natin dito sa software engineering track. So, yun. Um, I guess, well, that's all. Uh, hope magigets nyo yung whole people thing, understanding, uh, working with people thing dito sa track na to. And, uh, hopefully, by knowing those things, knowing these processes, these tools, and this mindset of people first, you could create much more reliable systems. And in effect, magiging mas mature yung ating uh, IT ecosystem as a whole, in one way or another. Okay? So, that's it. Enjoy!